again the sea of flags from Japan. What can he produce? Lying in fifth place, surely a medal is within his grasp if he can skate anywhere near his top form. Yuzuru Hanyu, the music, hope and legacy. Quads planned. First up, the quad loop. Brilliant. As good as it could be. Next seat's down in front of us for the Salco. He's got that as well.
probably the best figure skate ever. Just mind-boggling. And now the bouquet is cascading down all around the ice. What a mesmeric performance that was. There wasn't a flaw. Whether or not he gets a medal, and it's very probable now he will. How on earth, with all the pressure that was on him, and all the frustration that he must have felt in warm-up when it just wasn't going well, to come out and produce like that, the man is a phenomenon. For me, he has taken figure skating to a new level. He's the world record holder, and he's, I think, broken another record here with that free skate. Oh, without a doubt. That's, uh, yeah, the biggest free skate ever. Four perfect quads. The grade of execution on every element is, well, it's way, way up. In some cases, two and a half points added. That quad loop at the beginning of the program, at the end of the day, he got 14 and a half points for the one element. It is huge. And mentally, this guy, it's ridiculous what he does. Well, I was saying they were drawing off the energy of the crowd and drawing off the energy of each other. These guys love to compete. And this is an indication. He has thrown down the gauntlet to the other five guys in this last group. It's strange because he has looked more vulnerable in the last 12 months. And yet when it came to the real crunch and the world championships going for a medal, there wasn't a flicker of doubt, it seemed. And yet, go back seven or eight minutes to the warm-up. What was going on there? I know, it's crazy, isn't it? As you rightly said, it doesn't matter what happens in those six minutes. It's the four and a half minutes out there when you're on your own that count. And he took advantage of that. Lovely gesture. I tell you what, as well, going into this, the pressure off perhaps in his head a little bit because yes. he's not at the top. He's got to fight for it. He could win it from where he is now with that performance. Yeah. Brian was reiterating what you've been saying. It was calm and not so tense. Because he was the one looking up at the medals rather than looking down yeah. from first place. He came from a different place. And uh, looks like he, as though he's been putting the work in as well. It's going to be huge this score. Look at that! 223. It's the best ever free skate in history. He's beaten the total once before. That was in the...